as you can see, it's a little cramped. We're picking up our friend Melissa, yeah. and we're gonna go to the zoo, and we're gonna see some animals for Everly's birthday. Woo! Yay! <laughs> and me and him are getting a little close and personal. Luckily, he's gotten smaller since the last time we sat in the middle. So. <laughs> Bruh, we're heading out to the Woodland Park Zoo. Okay, we are here at the Woodland Park Zoo for Everly Rose's birthday. Uh, Evie Rose, are you excited? Yeah. Look, I see a dinosaur. We are here at the zoo. Look at this girl. Go, you want to go see the dinos? Evie, look what's over here. Dun dun dun. We got the T-Rex, the big daddy. Is he scary? Oh my goodness. What do you think of the T-Rex? Look at that guy, he's so cool. Okay, we're on our way into the heart of the zoo. Oh, do you wanna see the baby gorillas? Do you wanna see some gorillas, Evie? Oh my goodness, that sounds fun. Okay, from the looks of it, this is the tropical rainforest. And they got all sorts of critters. And we heard rumors of, dun dun dun, a baby gorilla. You guys excited for some baby gorilla action? Nobody's excited about an old gorilla. What the heck? I am. Me too. Happy birthday, Evie. <laughs> happy, happy birthday. Okay, we're on our way to see some baby gorillas. Let's go take a look. Oh, look at them. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, oh, look at the little, look at the little baby. Oh, look at the baby. Oh, the baby. That's so cute. Look at the little guy. So tiny. Oh Cute little baby behind the, t behind there, and look at Big Daddy Gorilla. I just worked a long day, and he's tired. Hey, buddy. No. What do you see, baby? Do you see the big gorillas? Oh, that's so cute. It's a girl born January 29th under the watchful eyes of animal keepers. Mom, baby, and troop are currently bonding behind the scenes. What do you guys think of the gorillas? Sight to see. They're so cute, the little tiny guys, They're huh? Adorable. Yeah, so we had to wait a little bit, but we were able to see not one, but two baby gorillas, which isn't something you see every day. That was kind of a highlight when we were here the last time of seeing some baby gorillas. And especially the big daddy gorilla that was really protective. It was really sweet. Today he was just chilling, but it was still fun to watch him. Making our way to see some flamingos. You see the flamingos, baby girl? Okay, there's a little drama going on here in the flamingo community. Turns out Jan over there 
she's been uh, texting her ex-boyfriend and it's been causing a lot of issues so oh and there's karen oh karen's she just asked for a manager <laughs> and then you got this duck down there just chilling what's up bro he's like us he's like the people watcher i know it's like you got y'all crazy okay we're moving we're moving on from the flamingos Got lots of birthday wishes. I know. What a special girl on a special day. <laughs> okay, it looks like we're headed to the wildlife survival zone. The red panda. This is for you, Bia. Hi, Red Fox. He's a red panda. Oh, red panda. Red panda. No, we're not getting a red panda. Dang it. <laughs> now in this habitat, that is called natural weeds. Natural weeds. I know. Look at these weeds. Dang, they're very natural. Interesting. They're weedy, and they need a whacker. This and is they're very green. interesting. Mm-hmm. The well, they decided to go green, and this is what they chose. Okay, we're heading into the wetlands. I've heard that they're wet. Holden, would you get the door for your mama? Yeah. yeah. Right. Wetlands. One door at a time, so don't open the next one until we're all inside. Yep. <laughs> Is, hey, Holden. Bird is a word. Bird up. Bird up. Stay tuned for some more hot bird action because that's where we're headed. You're the best door holder there, Mr. Oregon. Even though, we're, are you confused? We're in Washington, buddy. I don't know if anybody told you. Girls, caution. Bird up. Bird up. <laughs> oh, wow, that one looks like it's working. Oh yeah, no, that one's got like little Richard hair. It looks like little Richard, <laughs> he's been reincarnated as his bird, and he's. It looks like he's glitching. Oh yeah, and maybe the Matrix is doing something weird. Bro, you okay? I, th I think he needs a hug. What's this guy saying? He's like, "Yep, I'm Roman. What are you gonna do about it?" He's not Greek. He's Roman. That's your dad joke. Okay, we just had some delicious lunch here that Mama brought, and Evie's playing with her newfound dinosaurs that we just got her. What's your favorite? Oh my! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Is that even allowed? But so far, we're having a good day here at the zoo. We've seen some cool animals. A lot of stuff's closed, unfortunately, which is pretty lame. But are you having fun, buddy? Yeah. What's been your favorite critter so far? Probably the cookies we just had. Oh, I love the cookies. Cookies are good. Here we're at the African savanna. Oh my gosh. Oh, Look at those. Oh, there's a giraffe right there. Zebras and giraffes. That's so cool. Some giraffes and some zebras. Oh, look at this guy. Look at him. Whoa. Look at his tongue. Oh my 
From the looks of it, we're heading to the Temperate Forest Family Farm. Oh, oh. I don't know that you could meet him. I know, I wish they were in the petting zoo. So, why are you sanitizing your hands right now? I don't want no goat rona. Goat rona? Is that when you get licked by a goat? Yep. With coronavirus? You're gonna love this. Oh, <laughs> Look at this guy. Aren't they adorable? Or gal, or whatever. Oh, hey, buddy, how's it going? Oh, hey, don't have a cow. I know. I know. He just came back from Hot Topic. Look at him, Haley. Do you see how? Do you see how emo this guy looks with his hair? It's kind of weird because I think this cow is drinking Sam's cola. He just left his hair on the thing. I'll take it. Oh, that's yours. How's the birthday girl? Oh, she's like, she's. Look at her. She's like Cleopatra sitting in there. How's it going, Evie? Are you having a good birthday? Yeah, how's Bear doing? He's doing good. Meet the ostrich. The largest bird in the world. Um, Mr. Ostrich, bird up. <laughs> Dang, that's a big egg. How many chicken eggs equal one ostrich egg? Guess holding how many? Sixty. I'm gonna guess. Sixty? That's a lot. Twelve. I'm gonna twelve. Ten. Any other guesses? Wait, 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 wait. I need to change. I think thing. twelve. I'm gonna say eight. How Fifteen. How many chicken eggs fit in the ostrich? Egg? Thirty. So that's like getting a Costco thing in one. That's a lot of almonds. I don't know. I'd be full for days. Okay, one more thing. If I were eating ostrich eggs, I definitely I'd look like this guy with a big old smile. <laughs> Okay, we're heading to the Africa Savanna Trail, the Savanna Aviary Hippo Pool, Giraffe Barn, and the Lion Plains. Are you climbing up tall? Oh, she's on top of the world. Okay, we're here with the hippos. The hippo, it's kind of slippery. They greased it early this morning, so that could be why you're not sitting on it. That's, that's her tradition, is there's a guy that comes and greases the hippo, so. Like Dan said, this is really, really slippery. That's so Riding the hippo wave. Whoa, bro. Okay, kiddos, we're about to see some lions. Up He's close and personal. I don't get it. Oh He's always lying to me. Lying around. I think they call them lions because they just lie around. What's this girl doing over here? Oh, did you find, look at her. You found a mama lion and some cubs. A mama lion and cubs? We are headed to the Rhino Reserve. Reserve your rhino today. We're heading to the Rhino Reserve and luckily we reserved ours earlier. I asked for a gray one with black trim, so we'll see.
Oh, the rhino lookout. Now, you're required to look out for rhinos when you're here. Oh, I see one. Oh, it's just a picture of one. That's lame. Oh, these are those new clear see-through rhinos. Okay. About the only the only rhino okay. you're gonna see now. If you want to spend one hundred fifty dollars, you can see a picture of a rhino. How fortunate are we to see this picture of the rhino? Oh, the birthday girl is strong. Look at her. This is this another one of those invisible animals? More no-shows. More no-show animals. There's been a lot here today. Oh, there he is. Oh, man. You see the orangutan? Oh, whoa. Whoa, he's like a huge monkey. Monkey. That's nice. Oh wow, he's got a huge face. Oh, so cool. Remember in Chinta. Her 52nd birthday. Dang, that's old. <laughs> I don't know for monkeys, but one of the oldest orangutans in North America. What do you see down here? What a cute face. Oh man. They got some, they, they, this middle one reminds me of uh, Harry and the Hendersons, kind of. Oh, look at that big hand. Yeah. Okay, the one thing I really wanted to see, and I really hope he's here, is a huge grizzly bear. We learned the other day that they like rolling both in pumpkin spice and coffee. And coffee. They're so very basic. They're very basic. And we got a set of Uggs we're going to give to one. Uh-huh. You like grizzly bears, buddy? Yeah, I hope there's one there. Yeah, last time at the zoo there was a giant bear and I want to see that guy again. The bear's out here. I have had it, boo-boo. I'm gonna bust out of here. How come, Yogi? Every day it's the same old thing. Look at the bears, look at the bears, look at the bears. Sheesh. Okay, what do you guys think that bear's thinking right now? Um, that he really wants a, a frappe. Oh, he wants a frappe. Yeah. What do you guys think he's thinking? That he wants to eat everyone here. Yeah, oh, really? Definitely. He's hungry. Hey. What do you think the bear's saying? Um, yeet! <laughs> the, 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 the bear is saying yeet. I don't, well, <laughs> that's very possible. So. Bye, Mr. Bear. Bye. You sure are pretty. What a beautiful creature. Glad he's here and he's safe. Okay, I was actually able to see the big old grizzly bear and that made my day. So, well, I was able to recover at least a little bit from not seeing the rhinos and some of the other creatures, but the bear is pretty awesome. Oh man, look at the racers. Racing up the hill. Good job, guys. Is that fun? Well, keeping on brand. Even this is closed. Oh, there she goes. Okay, the carousel is closed, but she can act like she's riding. Okay, you gotta go up and down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, she's going all around, all around, all around. We are on the last leg of the zoo here, about to head out. How was your experience today, Mom? Um, it was okay. Like, uh, we have a membership to Point Defiance. We decided we wanted to go elsewhere to see different animals than what they have there because we've been there a lot. Pretty disappointing. Not a lot of animals out. And it's not like they were hiding because of weather. They were like not there to be seen. Tons of areas closed off. This place is pricey for the six of us to get in. It was $150. Plus parking. Plus parking. So... I wouldn't recommend coming here during COVID at all. I mean, granted, I like to keep zoos afloat and keep them going, but I'm, I, wouldn't, I won't come back during COVID. 
And what about this girl? How was the zoo? Good. I found have dinosaurs. So. She got some dinosaurs and she got to see some big dinosaurs as well, huh? My final wrap up. Yeah, it was good. Evie seemed to be unfazed by the closure. She just liked running around and being out here and seeing creatures. There was a lot of stuff that was closed, so as everybody else said, don't come during COVID times. There's just, I don't know if they're on some sort of weird schedule, but a lot of stuff is blocked off and closed. And we've gone to Point Defiance in COVID times and it wasn't an issue. A lot of stuff still open there and we thought it'd be a similar experience. Granted, there are different organizations and different zoos altogether. But if you are in Washington State and want to visit a zoo, go to Point Defiance in Tacoma. Much better experience for sure until they get things back up and running. If you like these adventure videos when we're going around exploring different places and locations, we'd like you to subscribe to our channel so you can see more. Also, if you enjoyed it or if you got value out of it, give it a big thumbs up. And we'd like to see you on our next adventure, so hit that notification bell. That way it can pop up and you can follow us along. So far, we've had two no-shows and one sick triceratops.